Hey everyone, and welcome to the Body Beers November release. It's been an incredibly busy month for Body Beers. We launched out of beta and we attracted 5,000 new accounts to Body Beers. And we still managed to find time to, to build and release a number of new features that I would like to show you today. So I'm just going to dive right in. The first new feature that I would like to show you is blocks. The reason why we created blocks was to streamline the design process. Blocks are pre-composed and predefined components that just abstract away a lot of the niggly design flows that people often experience when, when building these types of apps. For example, display data and then add in the filter and search. So I'm just going to jump in right now and add a new block. I think we'll go with the table block and we will bind that table block to our sales table. And then we will add a region search component, which means that we can search our table uh, by region. So if I preview that now, I can search for here and this should filter the table and only show the records that are within the region of Europe. So before blocks, this process, taking around eight minutes to build, but as you can see, it takes seconds now. And we will continue to build on blocks. And the way we will build on them is by studying common design flows and then abstracting those processes into these tiny and um, small and streamlined blocks. The next new feature that I would like to show is a popular request, especially from the enterprise organizations within our community. That new feature is an Oracle integration. And it's not just an integration, it's, it's also a data source plus, which means that you can fetch tables directly from your Oracle databases. For example, I've already configured um, the setup and I've already fetched the tables, but by just clicking this button, I was able to pull in all my tables from, from my database. So if I just click into this, I will be able to see all the data within that individual table within my Oracle database. And this makes it incredibly easy to set up, to pull in data, to edit data, but also to build user interfaces. For example, if I just delete these, uh, like this, I'm going to show you two features in one here. I'm going to also show you the new screen and creation UI. So I'm just going to click add screen. And then as you can see here, the tables within our Oracle database are displayed. I'll just select countries. I'll add that screen and body base will create crud screens. So create, read, update, delete, um, around that table. So in a matter of seconds, you have a crud app created from your, from your, from your, your Oracle database. Moving on to the next new feature. This one is the dynamic filter component, um, which is under the data drop down. Um, the dynamic filter component makes it incredibly easy to just add the, um, to add filtering to your data. And, and it's, it's, it's pretty rudimentary to set up too. So we can select which fields we would like the user to be able to filter their data by as well. But for this demonstration, we're just going to use all fields. And I'm just going to click preview here. And you can see that if I click on filter, I can filter my data and get quite granular with the filter. So I can go with, go with Europe and then we'll go with country. And click confirm. And you can see here that we've managed to filter the region whilst also filtering the country to display um, the results that we desire. And the last new feature that I'm going to demonstrate today 
is the ability to add a text on the design screen. It's quality of life and feature, but it's one that I really enjoy. So I'm just going to double click on the component and then just type. I can also edit the, the size as well using the action bar. So that's everything for this release demo. I hope you enjoyed it. It's been an incredibly exciting and busy month for us here at BuddyVace. I'd like to thank everyone for your support during the launch out of beta. It was, I'll never forget it. But thank you very much. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day and please go and try these new features. Thank you. Bye.